guys, welcome back to the channel. Now for step two in this whole Lowrance build project. I use XHD mounts. I'm gonna do a whole video on that. But I have a dual mount up front. I have two Garmin's and I'm adding the third Lowrance. Eventually I would like to have Garmin, Lowrance, and Humminbird just for comparison purposes and for the classes I teach. But at this point in time, uh, Humminbird just can't touch those the two big guys. So here we go. Um, first of all, I have a dual mount. So I'm extending it to a three-way mount. So let's take a look at the dual mount and what I'm going to do to extend it into a three-way mount now. Pretty awesome. This this is a XHD Goliath mount. I'll put the link in below in the description. It allows you so many, uh, you know, customizable ways to do this. This is an amazing mount system. Let's check it out. Let's get into it now. Guys, thanks for watching and thanks for subscribing. Let's get this channel big. You know what happens at a thousand subscribers? $50 gift card at chattyboys.com. What I have is, um, I have a GPS map 1022 and a 93 UHD. Now, what I'm adding is, is a separate drop down for my Carbon 9. Uh, you know, I use the live scope up here and I'm gonna use the active target down here. It's gonna be really great for doing some comparison videos. Um, I don't know if y'all wanna see that on the Lawrence pages, but if you do, what I'll do is I'll just post it. I wanna actually post it on the Lawrence pages because um, I can see, um, I've already done a lot of testing, but I'm having to go back and actually film this video because I missed it. Um, I'm already seeing the value of this, the active target. It is going to be amazing. Um, let me tell you what, it's uh, in front of the actual LVS-32, which is the current um, live scope. The LVS-34 is um, is the new one, but the current live scope, or the one that most people have, the active target, which will fit right here, is leaps and bounds in front of the LVS-32. So that is, that's pretty nice to know. I can't wait to get to do some testing on the new Garmin and put them side by side for everybody to see. But first of all, um, one thing I'll tell you I like about it is the crispness and the clarity and the target separation. <coughs> Amazing on the active target. But the first step was, is I just had this mount, but I'm adding this mount underneath it. Um, he offers a wide array of adjustable mounts at XHD mounts. It's uh, adjustable here. We'll swivel all the way back to here, all the way frontwards. There's so many ways to make this mount. This mount is very, very strong and durable. Uh, you can pick the boat up with that. It comes with all the available hardware. Um, that's not an ad. He just donates to the channel. He did not donate me money personally, but he did donate to the channel. <coughs> so as I get this bolted up and get the Carbon 9 bolted on, you'll see the next step. This is, like I said, an XHD mount. I'll put the link in the description below. Um, very, very nifty. He's got so many different options about how you can stack it. You have a lower mount. Let me pull that one right here. Um, you can actually have it like this, have this one a little lower. If you like, I wanted them stacked. That way I could get the third one underneath because I didn't want the triangle. I didn't want that third mount out here. Uh, I don't want it. I wanted all three in a line. So let me get back a little bit. I didn't want the third mount out here. I wanted the third mount straight in a line. So all three of these mounts, I haven't tightened up these bolts right here, but all three of these mounts are sturdy and solid. As soon as I tighten this up, it'll suck up right in there just perfect like that. All right, so guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And you ring know. a bell. And guess what? Got some Lorenz Lunatic hats coming, just like the Double G's. Got some LL hats coming too. Uh, gonna do some of those. They're fun, uh, pretty cool to have. Take a picture with uh, the fish you catch when you get some. Put it on the Lunar, uh, Lawrence Lunatic page. I'll put that little link down in the bottom. We're trying to grow that page too. Trying to make everything big and uh, make uh, Lawrence Lunatic your one-stop shop, baby, for all the tips, techniques, stories, horror stories, whatever you got, we're gonna do it. Thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and you know, ring the bell.